Oh boy, okay, well, this is actually <laughs> the biggest box here that, um, one of them, actually, so far that I've reviewed. Um, this one's likely, actually, is bigger than, um, the Sonic Movie 2 one, so, um, hey everybody, Speed Generations here, and today we have the Tornado Biplane playset, um, sort of playset, I'd call it. This is more of like a, you know, kind of a display piece kind of thing. Um, six sounds from the games are in this tornado, so I'm likely thinking it's the propeller noises, the um, actual noises itself, and probably a couple other sounds that I'm unfamiliar with, but this could mean um, that, uh, I'd need batteries, and I'm not sure if I have them, but I'll I'll have to look. But uh, let let's just let's just get this out of the box, cause like this 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 box is big. So by the way, yeah, here I sold separately. There's three AAA batteries, so yeah. So real quick, I'm just gonna move to my bed, um, and take this stuff off. So I'll put it like in a fast motion while I'm, uh, you know, speed this up to. You guys don't really have to, you know, um, deal with me slowly <laughs> taking everything off. You know, I didn't actually realize I was going it the wrong way. Um, next time I'll do that. Uh, uh, okay. That was too much fault there. Okay, so no matter what, this thing is actually still too big. Um, I just put it together off camera instead of putting it together on camera just in case there's any struggles. So yes, you do need batteries because I turned it on and yeah, this part. So uh, there's not really much, honestly, to like, because sometimes companies would just put batteries in. Um, the, um, the one example is that baby Garfield plush, the talking one, they already put uh, batteries in it. But then again, that was like for testing modes in stores. This is an actual box that doesn't have a testing ability mode capable to it. So that would make sense. As it goes for this guy, though, the one from the uh, Tornado biplane on um, he, Sonic, he's kind of just... He, he's the same as the oil ocean diorama. He's the same as the other ones. This is it's a it's a good Sonic. It's just we've had so many ones now, and it's, it's kind of just annoying. Um, I'm not a bit too big of a fan of uh, having Sonic for everything we get these days. Um, here's this, by the way. I'm pretty sure it won't do much because listen to this. Yeah. Um, there's something on the side. Yeah, you can't really press that. But this is this is the button to press for all your sounds. Um, I might test that out in a little bit. But, um, I won't lie. D Jax really needs to do something else besides putting Sonic in every single um, play set or whatever. They could put someone else in there for once. You know, something new. But I mean... That, that's fine, I guess. Uh, anyways. Uh, I know this was like Sonic first 
this was Sonic's plane. Um, there's an episode in Sonic X, and that is when Tails first meets Sonic, and Sonic was the one that originally owned it, even with his name on it. Uh, when you first look back to the games without knowing anything about Sonic X, or before you even knew about Sonic X, or before Sonic X came out, you probably had no idea that this was actually Sonic's plane, and they just put Sonic on it because, you know, Sonic rides on top of it. I, I mean, that's what I, for some reason, guessed when, uh, <laughs> this, uh, I saw the plane with this on the side, but, yeah, this was originally Sonic's plane until it turned into Tails's because, you know, but... Either way, uh, I'm gonna actually put Tails on here. I'm gonna grab my other Sonic too, by the way. I'm not I'm not gonna use this one, and I'm not gonna use that one. But uh, I'm gonna go grab my classic Tails and classic Sonic real quick. I just put Tails on, and I'm already gonna say, "Wow, this is actually awesome." I I like this a little bit better than the um movie one. But then again, that was probably just trying to scale with two point actual 2.5 inch figures and not uh. You know, something like this. I think. Oh. <laughs> I'll be right back. Uh, yeah. Don't, don't, don't do this. Yeah. Um, I learned my lesson for the day for something for a review. I uh, don't, don't, don't hold it like this. N never do it like that. Uh, I forgot what I was saying because this thing uh, broke on me unexpectedly. But uh, yeah, to be honest, this this is a better tornado than the movie one. Yes, the movie one was the first one we got, so that's what we used for so long. But the four inches could never fit in those ones. Okay, I was explaining about the four inches. But I'm going to test that out today for these ones. I'm pretty sure on Reddit I've seen pictures of people putting four inches in there, I think. Or I could be going blind, and it could be some other company that fits in there. Um, so I'm going to grab Snowboarding Sonic here. I'm going to take him off his snowboard. And yes, he'll definitely fit on here, because he's got like a peg hole and uh, stuff like that. So he'll definitely be able to, hopefully, yep, there we go. Okay, so there you go. You got the Jax 4-inch. Um, modern Sonic standing on top, so yes, your four inches can stand on top. Now, what we need to test out is the four inch tails. Um, I don't, I genuinely don't know how well this will go or work. That's what I'm scared about. So, give me a second. I know the camera's down, but this tornado is huge. I can't, you know. Yeah, no, he can't. Okay, so, unfortunately, the 4-inch tails cannot fit in here. He'll just fall right out. Uh, I guess I'll test this tails out, too, real quick. I mean, yeah, I know these aren't going to fit, but it's, this one's a little... Yeah, this is the best you'll get with it. So, no, for the 4-inch tails to go onto the tornado, that one doesn't work. So, I'd try something more like um the 2.5 inch figures not the four inches yes you'll be able to get a four inch modern scaled figure on the tornado um on like on top of this part of the tornado but you won't be able to get it here so that's kind of the sad part of uh of this set but then again it's meant for the small figures i remember when this was in that first announced i'm like i wonder what this is gonna be is it gonna be like the classic one it's gonna be like the one from sonic x or something and we had to wait a long time until it was revealed actually we waited until their new reveal stuff for sonic so like wave 15 and 16 they were doing those there at their um, convention, and then they announced Wave 17 and 18 for the 2.5-inch figures. And then we had to wait a couple more months or so later for Wave 17 and 18 for the 4 inches. But uh, that then they revealed this. So it took 
quite a couple months actually from when it's first revealed so uh i mean i'm still glad we have it but like i didn't think it'd take us this long um real quick before i end the video i don't i just don't want to make it too long i'm gonna see if i can try to find some batteries and um you know put them in i don't think i'll be able to find any but it's worth a shot okay so i only found one of them and then i need a screwdriver i just don't know where that is so what i'm gonna do instead is i'm gonna wait and eventually when i hopefully get this thing to have batteries if i ever want it to i'll put a short up of what it sounds like um i will definitely forget so you guys can remind me in a couple of days or so just in case i do get this thing to work so for now there's the playset the tornado biplane sort of playset um one more thing real quickly here is the sonic the hedgehog 2 um tornado and honestly i i like it but i also don't like it because every time i try to put this in the pegs it just plops right back out the rest of them seem to be fine it's just that but i mean compare it to this i mean look at that hold on hold on i know i have to clean up I'm going to do that right after this video, actually. I'm going to clean up some of the spaces and then get to editing the video. Anyway, um, yeah. There you go. So, yeah, this one is a lot smaller, but I do like this one a lot more. So, um, that's it for the video. I'm going to go clean up everything off this floor here and put it into something. Um, that's why I'm selling a lot more stuff off my Mercari right now because I'm trying to make space for it, and I don't have... This place does not... It's not suitable for so much stuff. So I'm trying to get rid of some of it, so that way I can have room. Um, don't worry, the Sonic stuff's not going anywhere unless it's duplicates. Uh, but everything else will be going that isn't Sonic. So... Uh, yeah, that's kind of why I think I'll have a bit more space after all my cars are gone. Uh, and then next is probably my turtle stuff because, again, there's still no room for that either. Um, after that, I think I just need to clear out some spaces from the boxes and whatever. But, yeah, that's that's not important to this video. I just figured I'd let you guys know because a couple times you spotted some of my floor and you're like, you need to clean up a bit. I'm like, okay, okay, I'm sorry. But... Yeah, um, I'm going to go clean up now. So, hope you enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.